after spending 40 years behind bars, Wayne Chapman is a free man tonight. The convicted child rapist had been held for years beyond his first sentence for child rape because the state had deemed him a threat. Last year, two clinicians, though, determined he no longer posed a threat and he was about to be released. That was when prosecutors charged him with exposing himself to jail staff. Today, a jury found him not guilty of those charges. As WBZ's Katie Brace reports, that sets him free. Do you have anything to say after all these years? Convicted child rapist Wayne Chapman said nothing as he became a free man after 40 years in prison. What say you? Is he guilty or not guilty? Not guilty. Last year, nurses at the jail said he exposed himself and performed lewd acts on himself. The jury acquitted Chapman of the charges that would have kept him in jail. Eric Tennant represented him in a civil case. I think when this, when he first got accused, I told you that I was very suspicious of these charges, and I think at the end of the day, it was the right result. Chapman served 30 years for molesting two boys in Lawrence. When that prison term ended, he was civilly committed because he was deemed too dangerous to release. Then last year, two psychiatrists concluded Chapman should be released, citing his age and his Parkinson's disease. Chapman has admitted to molesting hundreds of boys. He's the prime suspect in the disappearance of a 10-year-old Lawrence boy back in the late 1970s. I don't think there's anything I can say to change someone's feelings about him, and I understand those feelings. I really do. He's caused a lot of harm in his life. But I can tell you, at this point in his life, who he is and how he's deteriorated, he's not a risk. He's not a danger. Katie Brace, WBZ News.